5 weather with Mike Daniels. Always nice to have you with us here on News 5 at 5. That's a live look from our Rock Rim and Studio, 79 degrees in the springs. A little breezy out at the airport south at 18, but you can see here at Rock Rim in the studios, it's just calm right now. Very beautiful afternoon in progress. Live look from the Riverwalk, downtown Pueblo. 83 is the current temperature. Not a breeze to worry about anywhere across the city right now. Here's your big weather story. Here's what's going to happen around here for the next few days. We're going to have that downslope flow. That's a drying component as that air is pushed down the least slopes of the Rockies. High pressure large and in charge for the state of Colorado. It's also going to bring in some unusually hot air. We'll have near record or record high temperatures around here Thursday. Friday into Saturday as well. Tomorrow, uh, here's what you get. We're going to see sunshine as you walk out the door tomorrow morning. Temperatures at 8 a.m. into the 50s and 60s all across I-25. As we work into the afternoon hours, temperatures heat even more. Clouds will even be a scarce commodity. Yes, you could see a couple of fair weather clouds, maybe a sprinkle across some of the wet mountains, but that is just going to be it. The air mass is just going to be really dry throughout the entire day. In fact, that dry air mass going to stick around for us for at least the next seven days. These are updated 5 o'clock temperatures here on News 5, nice and cool across some of the higher elevations. Of course, you expect that in late September, Rye and Woodland Park right now with current temperatures into the mid 60s. Overnight lows, nice and comfortable. It's that time of the year, no matter how warm we get during the day. If we've got clear skies, it'll cool nicely at night. Overnight low temperatures, some good sleep and weather tonight. Highs tomorrow, even hotter than what we had today. Record high temperatures will be threatened over the next several days in Colorado Springs tomorrow. Well, we're barely going to miss that all time record high, but we'll smash it on Friday. 90 degrees the afternoon high temperature will tie the all time record high on Saturday. Then some cooler air starts to build in by Sunday. That's a nice looking day right there. A little breezy from time to time Monday into Tuesday as still another cold front works across the Rockies. And by this time next week, Wednesday, a high temperature of only 63 degrees. Haven't been there since in early September and for Pueblo first weekend of fall. Take a look right there. It's going to be painfully hot to launch that weekend on Friday instead of TGIF. You'll say TGIAC 96. That will miss the all time record high by one. You'll tie the record on Saturday. Thankfully 10 degrees cooler on Sunday and those temperatures fall off nicely by the middle part of next week. Feeling fine at 69 on Wednesday with mostly sunny skies. Canyon City you'll go from the 90s Thursday, Friday and Saturday to a high only in the mid 60s by next Wednesday and next Wednesday, by the way, the last day of September Woodland Park. Unfortunately, I've got you dry for the next seven days as well. If you're longing for that real September weather, that crisp, cool stuff, you'll get it Tuesday into Wednesday with mostly sunny skies. All right, time for traffic.